Hello, it's Fat Sword Trooper from Dust Chicken Gaming. Um, one of my uh, viewers has asked me to talk about some spells, so I just got into the the overall categories and searched under the word spell, and I've got two pages of items that come up under spell. Some of them don't actually have spell, like a Spellbound Atlas, for example. But here, um, this is a bl unusual blighted beak. Um, and it's got voices from below. This is one of the most common uh, spells that you can get. And spells are released at one time and you can put them on various items, whether it be weapons or, or, or skins um, or hats. And, um, you know, voices from uh, below makes your voice deep, sound like a bit like a heavy. Um, that's spell bad as well. There's no spells on that. Um, oh, this one here has got the bruised purple footprints. Uh, again, spells are only active during the Halloween or full moon phase, but there are a lot of servers that have those around, and there are, there are various ways in which you can um, call for full moon to be implemented. Um, this is a corpse grey footprints. Um, that's just an unfilled uh, fill book. Um, this one here has voices from below, also really common. Um, this one here has got exorcism um, and that's a quite a common one also again exorcism two of them with exorcism and this one here also has exorcism but Halloween fire Halloween fire is cool because it makes the flames look green that's pretty nice I like it um, this is uh, Halloween fire again so it's quite common to have these things with Halloween fire um, this is exorcism uh, and Halloween Fire looks pretty good. I like Halloween Fire. Um, again, Halloween Fire. I sort of got all sorts of different ones with Halloween Fire. This is a a bit of an unusual one. This is an energy orb flash flamethrower, and it has Halloween Fire. I d I'm not sure. Correct me if I'm wrong, but I thought that these things came around after you could actually put spells on things. Um, so I don't, this is a bit unusual, I, I don't know, is this glitched or was I, am I wrong? I thought spells were gone before you can put things on them though. Um, but yeah, anyway, it's just an just a observation. Um, this is a, a, a Australium, um, it has a Halloween fire on it. Um, and again, Halloween fire, <laughs> I, you probably get it, I, get, I like Halloween fire. Um, this one's got Halloween fire and exorcism and also Halloween Fire and Exorcism. So I've got a big collection of these things. Um, this one's got Exorcism only. This one here um, uh, has Exorcism. So Exorcism is one of the more common ones. Uh, this one has is, is got a spectral, a spectral spectrum and voices from below. Um, and it's all Collectors as well, which is pretty rare because co uh, Collectors cosmetics are pretty rare. Um, this one here has exorcism and these pumpkin bombs which are pretty cool because you know they, they shoot out like pumpkin bombs now um that's uh uh yeah it looks pretty pretty interesting when it happens uh this one here has got pumpkin bombs as well um and uh this is exorcism uh this one has pumpkin bombs this is a genuine but some some someone's put uh some pumpkin bombs on it uh this one here has pumpkin bombs but I don't know, can a vintage gunslinger actually have pumpkin bombs? I don't know. Uh, I don't know. I don't know how that works. That's spellbound, so it has no spells. This is all supposed spellbound, but no spells. Um, this one here has got... Uh, uh, this is weird. I got this one here um, gifted, um, and, you know, it's got pumpkin bombs and exorcism on it so it's a spelled golden frying pan uh, this is this is a interesting uh, an interesting item this is a painted cow mangler there are only about eight of these round this one is uh, it's called the power of the void um, it's in balaclavas of forever it's uh, it's a relatively you know it's a named item that people have heard of and it actually has an exorcism spell on it. Again, Dead of Night, Sinister Stating. This is a cloudy moon 
coffin kit with headless horseman Halloween. So this is a really rare unusual with a spelter boot. Um, Haunted Metamedes, uh, Bruise Purple. Um, this one here is a Cloud Nine Antlers, but it also has voices from below. Again, another unusual with violet, uh, a violet, uh, violet, violet footprints. And here you go, Bruise Purple. So two, two engineered NG Misks um, with, with Bruise Purples. This one here, um, Spectral uh, a Spectrum Spell. And um, this one here is quite good because it's got both putrescent pigmentation and the violet uh, footprints. This one again, Footprints and Spectral Spectrum. Um, often if you look in the Haunted items, a lot of those for some reason ended up with spells. I guess but because they can be used at the same time. This is Rotten Orange Footprints and Voices from Below, but on a reasonably decent uh, Unusual too. Uh, th this is po uh, Poison Shadows with Headless Horseman uh, Footprints. Um, again, Sinister Stating on a Demon Flame, which is a high tier. Um, unusual. Now, the use of these summer shades often have, for some reason, spells on Spectral Spectrum, ha uh, Spectral Spectrum, Putrescent Pigmentation. Um, this is a double spelled one, the Footprints as well as Spectral Spectrum. Uh, this is a Gangrene, uh, Rotten Orange Voices from Below. Um, this is uh, Team Spirit. Uh, this is uh, Sinister Staining. So that's only one page. So basically most of those have got spells on. But then there are a lot of spells also on quite, some quite hun uh, high tier unusuals. This one here is the only Grand Master I've seen. It has Team Spirit footprints in it. It's pretty unusual. Um, it's quite a, quite a nice item to have that. Um, the other items are, you know, Demon Flame Pyromancer's Mask with Corpse Grey footprints. This one here is Knife Storm, okay, and, and Pyromancers with voices from below. And, um, I mean, these all have spells. I mean, this is even, even this one has rotten orange footprints. But look at this here. Green Black Hold with Corpse Grey footprints. Chromatic Corruption on Scorching Flames. Um, this is Dark Blaze, which is a really high t uh, a tier item with Headless Horseman uh, footprints. Um, Dead Presidents and... and um, with Arcana, this has also got... Has this got any spells on it? Yeah, Headless Horseman's um, footprints. So there, there are some really good spells on this. Um, and, uh, I mean, this is another one I like. The Degroot Experience, Bonzo the all Gnawing. And it's got the putrescent... And, and so it's got a Halloween effect with a Halloween item. Um, it's a Killer Exclusives. That's a double spelled with Sinister Staining and Team Spirit footprints. Bruised uh, purple footprints uh, and uh, chromatic corruption. So there's some uh, really good ones. Uh, here goes a, is a heavy one, headless horse and uh, uh, with a large luchador uh, in purple confetti. So there's some really interesting uh, variations of items, and um, you know spells are just something to look at. Uh, my f probably my favourite spell is this one here, chromatic corruption. Uh, which is, you know, there's some distortion of uh, the, the the light around the hat, which looks pretty good. This one is also an unusual to boot. That's probably one of the rarer ones, chromatic corru um, uh, corruption, and it's one of the ones that I, uh, I tend to sort of look out for. Peace.